reality, there cannot be thunder and lightning with no atmosphere. Yeah, that's what I mean. And there it is. A spaceship. And it fires lightning at us. Look out! Makers of Jungle Oats and Black Cat Peanut Butter bring you the incredible adventures of the most amazing man of our time, Jungle, and his black leopard, Jupiter. A fantastic pair who fearlessly fight evil wherever they find it. Tonight, Project Far Star. When the world is trouble, and you need a mighty friend, who will come on your back Cat peanut butter is made from pure, rich peanuts. It's packed with energy-giving goodness. And the taste, mmm, well, children love it. Black Cat peanut butter. It's the energy-giving sandwich bread. It's the greatest taste right next to bread. It's the one that helps you get ahead. Anyone hurt? No, no. All right, helmet on, spaghetti. Get a spare suit for Cat Sam. Get Jupiter fitted out. Hurry, please. Oh. Come on. This is Jet Jungle, Project Leader, Fast Star. We're in trouble. Hold on to your horses. We're going to take evasive action. Roger, Jet. Jay, okay, what's going on out there? Who's blasting it, big boy? I'll talk later. All right, let's see how this spaceship of ours, plus the other two attached to us, can act in an emergency. It's been geared up exactly for this. Let's move her about the skies, shall we? The alien spaceship there, turning and following us. Okay, we dive. Yeah, we missed it. That's right. Now, can we outclimb that thing? It's keeping pace with us. Ah, uh, is Jupiter okay, Sam? Yes, he's all right. Sam, keep an eye on Ket and Dr. Ket, will you? Are they all strapped in? Yeah, they're all strapped in, DJ. Looks like we can't outspeed them. We can't outmaneuver them by the dusty dens of Denevola. What kind of weapon do they have? Exactly like a lightning bolt. Sam, take over controls. I'm going out there. Right, Jack. The small rockets fitted to my heels, are they? Yes. Okay, Sam? Got the controls, yes, Jack. All right. Uh Yes, what are you going to do? Sneak up on them somehow, Spaghetti. All right, hatch. Open. (laughs) Spaghetti, close it after me, please. Okay. Yes. All right. Well, there's the enemy ship. Only about 300 meters from us and parallel with us. Okay, Jet, drop back a bit. Incredible example of lightning. Flashes from that spaceship to the fast our ships. Much more of that and our ships will shatter. I don't know how they're still up to the impact already. I have no time to work it out. Get to that enemy ship. Aha, uh-huh. moving through space. Incredible sight from here. Fast our craft over there and the enemy spaceship right below me. Uh, they connect again? Yes. But our ships are still taking the strain just. And that lightning is being fired from the side of the spaceship below me. Okay. Down we go. Mm-hmm. And there we are. All right. So we walk quietly on the spaceship and it's a kind of a gun. Here's yeah, a long, thin barrel, I wonder. All right, Jet, let's see how strong you really are. <laughs> Bend this barrel back and point it at the ship at itself. I don't know what kind of metal this is. It, it, it's tough. Jet? <laughs> Jet, the ship hasn't fired for some time. I know, Sam. Anything we can do? Just wish my biceps good luck, Spaghetti, that's all. 
bending. The barrel is bending. Bending, and I bent it in a U. Right, now to get away from here. Sam, did you see what happened? We saw. That ship just disappeared. What did you do? I just turned the gun on the ship. What gun? I'll explain my gun, you spaghetti. I'm coming across now. Everything all right with our craft? Everything should be so okay, Jim. Good. Joining you now. Our ship has been destroyed. How? I'm not sure how. We sent a ship to destroy Jet Jungle and his friends to destroy Project Firestar. You know we did this. We had to. A cosmic disturbance pushed our prisoner Ket to them. It could not be allowed that she live. But she does? Yes, she does. And our main battleship is destroyed. I would give half the kingdom of Armageddon to know how Jungle did it. And also the woman, the Earth woman, Dr. Ket... She's not so receptive to my thought commands now. Why? We know not, Noran. Perhaps because... Yes, it must be so. That the true cat is with her. Yes, it must be this. What will happen? We have nothing to fear. They will come to us. And then, Noran? Then, when they come to us, we destroy them. And after? After, we move out of this cosmic position further from the planet called Earth. We move into the sons of Kirian, Hidiret, and Gandan, and we conquer life there. It must be so. Ours is a warlike people. We, the astral beings, were born to conquer or vanish in the attempt. don't believe it happened. Well, it did. Well, I know it did, but I don't believe it. Well, you'll have to, Spaghetti. No, I need to find you, Tony. But, but what? How long to arm again? Um, a day and a half now, Spaghetti. Listen, why don't we make a contact with Earth? Tell them that we're all seasick. Up here? Well, seasick, air sick, space sick, lightning and thunder sick. What's the difference? Then we go home, back to Orion's Peak, and we plant some oak trees. Some what? Oak trees. Oak trees? Oak trees. Okey doke trees, okay? <laughs> okay. <dokey. laughs> mm. <clears throat> uh, spaghetti? Well, I have to finish what I think I was about to say. We plant some tiny oak trees from the acorns. And we do not leave Orion's Peak until they are grown. Mm. Which will take. Uh... And you'll be full grown? Oh, about 20 years. Oh, come on, Spaghetti. You know you love this kind of thing. Adventure? See, uh, sometimes. Not all the time, huh? No, not all the time. All I ask is that when this project fast is over, yet. That we do get to Orion Peak. That we do spend a little time there. Uh, spaghetti, look, uh, I'll see what I can do. Huh? Uh, don't see what you can do. Do it, please. <laughs> I think it's time we checked with our fellow astronauts. Um, Sam, please. Okay. Fast hour one to fast hour two. How are you? Oh, fine, honey, just fine. Look, when we get near Armageddon, it's, uh, let's get this undocking done, huh? We feel safer flying around under our own power, which is most light on you, Mr. Jungle. Not the way you knock that thing out, but, you know. Hey, always, babe. Know that? I bet he stares into the first asteroid he sees. Now we're all okay in here. Well, that's good to hear, Fasta 2. Fasta 3, how are things? Well, things are okay here, honey. Hey, what was that thing like bubble came flown up near a command ship some time ago, huh? Uh, it, it was a little woman, about two feet high, blonde hair. Very pretty. You know, ma'am, isolated as we are out here, you've got a rough sense of humor, you know that? No humor, it actually happened. You'll see when you join us here for briefing after undocking. Just off Armageddon. Okay. Hey, uh, uh, Samantha Muller, honey, does, uh, she look like uh, anything like you, huh? If she does, ma'am, you can all send her down here. We'll keep her company. <laughs> <laughs> Otherwise, everything's okay in Far Star 3. Thanks for asking. All right. Uh, nice to hear you're all okay. 
Wow. Just look at those two. Uh, which two, Sam? Dr. Kett and Kett the tiny woman. As fast asleep, it seems. Hmm. Yes, sir. Yeah. What does that mean? I was trying to work things out, Spaghetti. I think, um, well, Kett has modeled herself physically on Dr. Kett. Modeled herself? She can do that? You mean take different shapes? Sam, I, I think so, yes. Don't ask me how I know. It's just a guess at the moment. Anyway, I think she's modeled herself on Dr. Kett, and she's looking to Dr. Kett to help her. And for us to help as well. Yes, yes, of course, Spaghetti. And my friends, right now? Well, they're probably in, I suppose, a kind of mental communion. That's right, Sam. Well, we just have to ask them when they wake up. Yes, we'll have to, yes. That's strange. Hey, you don't think when all this is over that I take little Kit home with us and keep her as a mascot? Uh-uh. Mm, spoiled spoiled. <laughs> and you think she can change shapes? I think so, yes. Just a... Uh... Something a hunch, just an idea that came to me, yeah, Spaghetti. So, so why couldn't she change out of the bubble, the prison bubble? Spaghetti, I didn't think she could walk through substance, did I? Mm. Well, we'll see. Jed, do you want me to wake them up? Mm? Uh, no, sir, I'm letting them sleep on now. Yeah, what's going to happen? Spaghetti, please, how many times do I have to tell you to... No, I don't know. Yeah, but you don't seem to worry. Me, I have gray hairs beginning to show. Beginning, Spaghetti. You be <laughs> quiet. <laughs> And you shut up too, Blackhead. Well, we know we can die. Any moment. That's right, Spaghetti. Any moment. That's Jungle Talk from one of the kings of the jungle. He's got a healthy roar because he eats a good meal every day. It's the same with you growing youngsters. Get into good eating habits every day and you're roaring to go. I'm swimming in the morning, riding in the afternoon, and at the weekend I'm going on a fishing camp with Sam. <laughs> That's Jungle Talk. With Jungle Oats for breakfast every day, you're getting all the natural goodness of golden, sun-ripened oats. With nourishing Jungle Oats for breakfast every day, you're ready to take on anything. Jungle Oats, South Africa's champion energy breakfast. <laughs> You, you made the fun. Yeah, <laughs> you made the fun because you know I like the fun. <laughs> now, mind you, I like the fun as I make better like the fun as you make because uh, the fun is... Spaghetti, please. Yes. Hmm? You are serious? Um, no, I'm not. Oh, thank you for telling me. <laughs> yeah, but I know what you mean. Yes, of course. And, Spaghetti, we can expect another attack at any time. In fact, you my old friend, we may not escape this one. Hey, kids. Jet Jungle Bicycles are at all OK Furniture branches. Only 69 Rand, with free crash helmet for club members. Listen every night, Monday to Friday, to the adventures of Jet Jungle, the fittest man in the world. Project Firestar was brought to you by the makers of Black Cat Peanut Butter and Jungle Oats.